Thank you very much for joining me. Uh, we have a couple things that we're going to be making today. Some really cute cards. Um, the card or the stamp set that we're going to be using today is Darling Donkeys. Um, this is a set that you will be able to earn free out of our celebration catalog. Um, this goes into effect January, uh, the beginning of January. So I'm just going to show you some ideas of some uh, cards that you can make with this really cute set. Um, celebration is a really fun time. You can earn a ton of free product um, starting at like the $50. If you spend $50, if you spend $100, you, you get a bunch of stuff out of this catalog for free. Um, so it's a great time to stock up on some items. Um, we also have a sale going on. It's a 50% off sale. So check out my website for that. Uh, it's a bunch of product out of our catalog that we are just about finishing up with. Um, this catalog ends in December or, or the end of December. So the majority of this catalog, there's a lot of product that's gonna be retiring, um, some product that they're not gonna carry anymore. So 50% um, off, you can't go wrong with that. Um, you can even get a bigger discount if you were to choose to um, be a demonstrator. Um, you could do it just for a hobby, just for a discount, um, but you can get extra discounts on that as well. So nothing's better than getting discounts. <laughs> Um, so thank you very much again for joining me. Um, if you would like, comment, share on my post. Um, let me know that you're here. Let me know where you're from. And we will get crafting. Um, so again, we're going to be using the Darling Donkey set. Um, this is one of the sets that you can get free. And I will just show this to you in the catalog. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but it's a really cute set, and we're going to be making some cards, so we will get started. Um, let me just turn you down. Oh, and before I do, um, if anyone places an order today through Saturday, um, I will be sending you a gift, and this is our pool party sheer ribbon. So if you spend $50, um, I'll have the host code put up, so once you type in that host code, and choose me as your demonstrator, um, then I will know to send you a free brand new uh, spool of ribbon. <laughs> um, also, if by chance we do hit 25 viewers, I will be doing a drawing um, for some linen thread. Um, it's a very versatile ribbon thread. I don't know what you want to call it, um, but you can use it for just about any kind of card or crap that you make. So. We'll be doing a drawing if we hit 25 viewers. So please share the video, do a little watch party thing so we can get some extra eyes out there. All right, so let me put this on the side. All right, let me just grab my stuff here. All right, let me just turn you down. All right, there we go. Okay, so this is the card that we are going to be making. Isn't that really cute? A really nice, simple, cute card. So we will get started. So I have a piece of um, Pacific Point. Uh, this is a really pretty blue. And this is eight and a half by five and a half. And we will just fold this in half. push that down and then we got our card and then we will be taking from our designer series paper um this is from uh the brights collection so we're just going to be putting whoop, and we'll just attach that down and i'm using our stamp and seal plus and this is one of my favorite glues it just really really holds nice. All right, so we have that. And then I have some scrap pieces of paper. Um, this is also from that same designer series pack of paper. 
Um, so we will be using that. We'll just glue these down. Well, as we're doing that, I'm just going to log on my other computer here so I can see your comments. All right. All right. Let's get the stuff glued down. A little bit in there. Oop, really sticks to the desk. <laughs> All right, so we will just put that right there. And then we'll grab this pinkish colored one. And we'll put that just right next to it. Again, this, oops, that was a little crooked. Again, this is just a really cute, simple, easy card to make. And we'll get our pool party color down. Fold that glue down just a tad. So again, please comment, share, let, let me know where you're from. That would be great. All right, we'll put that down there. Okay, so now I will grab, and where did I put my little donkey? We'll Pre-cut a donkey, where did he go? Oh, there he is. Okay, so we are going to take our cute little donkey here and we're going to stamp. So we will just put him on a block. He's so cute. All right, and then I'm going to be using our soft suede ink. We're just going to ink that up and place him down on there. I'm just going to put him just a little bit to the side. There we go. Just move this. All right. So I have some um, pens here, some markers, and we are just going to color him just a little bit, just to make him like really cute. We're just going to outline just a little. I'll turn them so you can see. I'm just going to outline him a little bit here. So is everyone all ready for Christmas yet? Any Christmas plans? I know it's kind of hard to make some plans with all this COVID stuff going on. But hopefully within your family, you know, you'll be able to get to do something fun. All right, so we have him there. Now we're just going to take a little bit of this color here and just color in his little feet. I know what would they be? Hooves? I'm not sure. All right, we'll color in his tail a little. I really love these markers because you really can't do anything wrong with them. Just add a little bit there. All right, let me just grab a little bit of pink. But what we're going to do is we're going to take our blender pen and we're simply going to just rub the end of the blender pen so I can have this color but it'll be a little lighter. I'll just color that in. It'll just be really cute. There we go. Add a little pink to the ears. I don't know. Do, do donkeys have pink on their ears? I'm not sure. This one does. He's cute. All right, so let's clean off that blender pen. And then we will take the pink out again and just kind of pink up this flower. And we'll grab our Wink of Stella and just put a little glitter on the flower. Everybody loves a little glitter. All right, so we have that. And then we will stamp our sentiment on just a scrap piece of paper. This is a good card to clean up some of the scraps that you have. 
I'm thinking in the next week or two, I might do a Facebook Live on how to clean up your scrap bin. Because I know I have a lot of them. And it's silly to keep buying things if we can use up what we have. And then we'll make room for all the new stuff. All right. So we will ink up our sentiment again on the soft suede. And we will just put that down here just like that. There we go. Grab our little snips. Hi, Linda. Thank you for joining me. I really appreciate it. I'll just cut that. And then we will grab our dimensionals. And with this, talk about using up our scraps. It's always good to use up the end pieces on this. All right. There we go. So again, I do have that ordering special. So if you purchase, um, if you place an order for $50 today, you will be sent from me uh, that brand new spool of the pool party ribbon. It's like sparkly and shimmery. It's really pretty. So I will happily send that out to you. All right. Then we are going to add, going to add a little bit of these rhinestones on here. Uh, we'll use up some of these blue ones. I don't know if you can see that. I had to use a different way to do the Facebook today. So we will make do. There we go. Oh, see? Doing it upside down. Just move that down just a bit. There we go. Very nice. Okay, so we will put him onto our card and we will grab, ooh, that one's empty. We'll grab some dimensionals and put that on the back. Yeah, I am so excited for celebration coming. Oh my goodness, they have so many cute things that you can earn for free. Oh my goodness. And then the new spring catalog is going to be coming out. And I was able to preview all of that and pre-order some of the stuff. So that that that's one of the perks about being a demonstrator. You do get to see the previews of everything. And you get to pre-order things. So that's really cool. All right. So this is the card and all we are going to do is just add a little ribbon to the card because I thought the card itself was a little plain. I thought I could use a little ribbon and we're just using our, let's see here, this is our, oh goodness, all right, a really cute yellow ribbon. I can't pronounce what they're calling it. <laughs> All right, we'll just make this real, real quick. All right, we'll just trim this up with our scissors. There we go. Let's grab a little mini glue dot. And then don't forget, uh, there's that half price sale off of the stuff in the holiday catalog. So you'll want to take advantage of that. All right, so we will just put that little bow right here. There we go. So what do, what do you think of these, of, of this card? I think it turned out pretty cute. All right, so we will move on to the next card. Again, we're going to be using our Darling Donkey set. And again, this is a free set that you'll be able to get out of the celebration. Right, and this card, oops, reach. This is a cute card. It says, Hey there, friend. I thought it was really cute because we made some little hay bales here. I thought that was just darling. All right, so we will get to making this one. All right, so on this one, I had taken a piece of crumb cake and I had cut it the basic card size, the eight and a half by five and a half. And all we're going to do here is just fold this in half. 
Um, and then don't forget, uh, I still have my Black Friday sale going. I do have limited stock available on some of the items. So if you are interested, um, please check out my Facebook page uh, for the link to order any of the uh, Black Friday sales. I have a basic tool kit, an embellishment kit, a ribbon kit. Um, there's a bunch of classes that are available and a bunch of other stuff. And then if you're not sure what you want or you have a crafter that you don't know what to get for them, I also do offer gift cards. So that's some something. All right, so I also took another piece of crumb cake and I had cut this a little smaller. I cut this at five and a quarter by four and I had used the pine wood planks um, embossing folder. So this goes with the new stamp and cut or or I'm sorry, the stamp and cut and emboss machine. Uh, it's a real cool, cool machine. So uh, this is a really nice embossing folders and this is the one that I used. Put that on the side and we're just gonna glue this one down. Get on there. Oops. Sometimes it gets a little stuck. There we go. And we'll just put that down on here. Perfect. There we go. Yes, it's the same color, but you have that texture. I don't know if you can see that, but it has some nice texture. It looks like wood. All right, so we are going to assemble our little makeshift barn that the donkeys are in. So I have more of the uh, Brights collection of, of the designer series paper. Um, so, so you get a pack of six by six. And I know I've shown this pack before, um, but, but you get so many different patterns and colors. Let's see if I can pull that out a little bit. Yeah, there's a bunch of really neat uh, designs in here. So there's that. All right, so let's make our little barn. So we are just going to glue these down real quick. We'll put one about here. And then we will cut that. And then put one on the other side here. And we'll just raise this one up a tad. So there were, were really no measuring for these two pieces. So we are just going, like I said, we're using our scrap. I'm just going to trim them at the bottom. Just like that, so we'll get rid of these. And then we have our roof. So we are going to put that down, but we are going to put that down with some dimensionals. I want to give that just a little extra pop. That. So I was out in the yard today and I was letting my chickens run around for a little while. I cannot believe that it was so warm today. And it's December. Gosh, I think last year at this time we had a bunch of snow already. All right, so we are going to glue down our hay bales. All right, so we want to glue on this side. Um, these first two we are just going to lay flat. I'm just going to put that right here. Okay, I'm going to trim that up just a little bit. It happens when you don't wear your glasses. All right, and then. And we'll just glue this one down as well. There we go. And then these hay, ba hay bales, we are going to um, put dimensionals underneath them and get them popped up just a tad. One on there. On the back of this one. All right, we'll put this one right about here. 
And then we will put this one right about here. And this last one, we are going to stamp our sentiment. And again, the sentiment on this one is, hey there, friend. I think it's kind of a cute uh, saying, especially when you're sitting on little hay bales. All right. Ink up the stamp and card out of the way, and we'll just stamp this. There we go. And I would like this one just a little bit higher than the other one. So we are going to put two dimensionals on the back here just to make it stand up just a little more. All right. I'll put that right in the center. And then we will take our little donkeys again these little guys are just so cute and we're just going to color them in a little bit so we're going to take our marker here and just kind of outline again just a little we're just going to do a quick little outline on him there we go so I had stamped this out and then I just fussy cut these little guys ahead of time. It doesn't take long to do that. All right, so get that going there. There we go. And then we will just take our blender pen I love these blender pens. They're so nice. And then we're just going to go around just a little bit. I had used the Sahara sand um, paper, and that's when I had stamped this little guy on. So we're just going to give him a little brownish color. So I don't know if you can see the difference there. Let's just circle through that, color his face. There we go. All right, and then we'll just grab a little bit of this really light pink and the other side of the blender pen. Just pick up some ink on there, make it just a little lighter than before. Oop. There we go. We'll just color his little nose in, little lips. Color this guy in. So the coloring really doesn't take very long, but it's really cute. Really cute. All right, so then we need to add a little bit for his hooves, his little feet. Add that. Oh, and can't forget his hair. He's got some really cute hair. All right. All right. So there's our little our little donkeys. Now we are going to attach them to our card. We'll put one there, and we'll put one on his head. All right, and this guy will have him like he's jumping. Put him there. We'll put dimensionals on the other one. All right. And I'll just put him right there. All right, so we have that, and then we're just going to add some more of these holiday rhinestones. Just going to add a couple on here. Let's see, put one there, and we'll put one here, and one more. There we go. All right, so what do you all think of this? I think this is a really cute all-purpose card. 
Uh, if you haven't seen someone in a while, you can always send them one of these cards. It's a nice little hello. All right, so that, let me flip you back out. Okay, so that is what I have for you. Um, I really hope you like these cards. I think these are both super cute. Cute all-purpose cards. All right. Um, so just a reminder, um, if anybody would make a purchase of $50, I will send out that uh, brand new spool of ribbon. Uh, it's really pretty. It's a nice sheer, sheer ribbon. It's a pool party color. It's really pretty. So we have that. Um, also have all the Black Friday sales. Please be sure to check that out. Um, I do have a class that's coming up. Um, I have a Simply Citrus kit class. So if you purchase the kit, we are gonna be doing a Zoom together and we will be um, making 15 cards all together. And so grab a snack, grab a glass of wine, grab some coffee, whatever it is that you drink and we can craft together and we'll be able to talk to each other during the Zoom, so that's always fun. Um, and then I have a poinsettia card class. Let me just show you these cards. So we have this one. Oh, yep, there we go. Warm wishes, we have that. And then we have one in red. This is really pretty and you can see on the red, we have the Winka Stella on there, and that's really pretty. And we have a Happy Holidays, because there's Christmas, there's Hanukkah, there's New Year's, there's the whole holiday season. So we have this card. Um, and then we have a really fun fold card, and this is really pretty. Um, it's, it's kind of like an easel card. Uh, it's really cute. And this is Warm Wishes. So I have this class and I'm actually offering it for free. Um, if you place a $25 order, um, I will send you this for free. So again, with my special, if you spend the $50, you get the ribbon and you would get the cards. If you spend the $25, you would get the cards. So that I believe is all I have. Um, again, if you have a crafter and you don't know what they might be looking for, let me know. I can send you a gift card. I can email it to you. Um, so that is really all I have. So happy Wednesday and have a very blessed evening. Have a good night. Bye-bye.